And there it is. Sentinel Strider Doom. Now, Yipes, uh, sorry, Clockwork likes to switch the orders on these teams, so it's, it'll be a surprise to see where he starts. There okay. it is. He's going to start uh, Strider. Doesn't try and build the super, says so Strider's going to build the super all by himself. You know, it's very scary to start Sentinel these days against a Magneto like Yipes. He's got so many openings that I, I like the choice of starting Strider. He's got his orbs going. Oh, it takes the trade from Psylocke right there, but he gets away. Wow, nice crutch fierce right there. Uh, Clockwork's going to get his meter, activate the orbs. Yipes is playing it smart right now. He does not want any part of those orbs. There is not an easy way to is. hit this opponent. There it is. Got it up. Got that the could combo. Be the end for Magneto. I do think that this will be the Will end it of take Magneto. it out? No. He lives. Yes. He went for an extended combo right there. Uh, Clock oh, no. a little bit hungry. Oh, what a turnaround. A little oh. bit too hungry. Unbelievable. And that is the heartbreak of that yes. team. That, uh, Clockwork, a little bit too hungry in the air right there. Didn't just take the damage that he could have gotten for free. And he loses his uh, loses his Doom Assist right there. Clock Sentinel, he put a lot of work into this character. Certainly no slouch in this department. But of course, Yipes plays against some of the best Sentinels in the world all the time. Check out Clockwork making use of that Strider Assist. It looks like he's not, as scared of, he's not afraid for him to die right now. I think Clockwork recognizes if he kills Storm, then Sawat comes in and she dies for free. He doesn't need that Strider now without the Doom. Oh. Chance at uh, the infinite right there, the combo that Storm would have been able to uh, seal the round with. DAC not going to do it. Oh, very, Balls very out. close right there. Uh, OG play right there, taking the hit, rolling the sideline butterflies and going for the punish right there. You got to be very experienced to know that. Quick stop right there from Clockwork. Goes for the guard break. No good. Clockwork, not the strongest oh. Sentinel player. Uh, still concentrating on Strider Doom. Oh, a couple opportunities yeah. there late in the match for Clockwork. That's this, gonna be this, tough. This is where we see from Clockwork so much. Strider or, or Doom dies, and the Sentinel comes in, and he's just not able to seal the deal. You know, I just think when you have a, a specialist character like that, like a Strider or a Spiral, that you can't put the time in a Sentinel that you need to. But uh, the rewards from Sentinel, you know, you, you need to have the highest level at this point. The rewards are too great to ignore. Especially against Yipes, there's really no way you can sleep on that Definitely. and uh, have any any sort of uh, dead weight on your team. Yeah. So this is uh, winner's bracket action. Yipes takes the first game against Clockwork. Here come the orbs. Uh oh, falling just right down on his head. Another opportunity right now. Let's see how he does it. Oh, he went for that reset. Not close enough for that grab right there. And uh, Yipes fights out of it. Very, very uh, quick right there. Great presence of mind from Yipes. Just like Marvel, we're tagging in commentators here. Oh, hit by the drones. Is Yipes going to try to get out? No, he does not want to take his Magneto safely out and bring in Storm. He just wants to press. He just wants to press. Okay. There he is. He's going to take Magneto out, bring Storm in safely. Hopefully Magneto can heal a little bit of that red life now, and that is what that red life is for. Always, get him out of there, heal yeah. him back. Always a chance left. Magneto only needs one hit to kill three characters, so uh, look for Magneto to come back. Now, Yipes is going to just try to play it safe with Storm right now. He does not want to eat any of those beams from Clockwork's uh, Sentinel. They can come out of nowhere and mess with Storm as he tries to do hailstorms. Plus, those Doom Rocks do huge chip damage, so Clockwork can play a pretty safe game from full screen. Unfortunate right there. Clockwork going for the snapback and then he was going for some unblockables. But the Doom Rocks worked not in his favor and brought uh, the Yipes and Storm right back in. Oh, incredible guard break combo right there. Zero meter but huge damage right there. The unblockable into the Strider assist. I guess Clockwork is putting me on notice. He knows how to play Sentinel a little bit. Uh-oh. In his face, IFC Yipes. He doesn't, he's not going to let Clockwork breathe right here. He's going to try to just push him into the corner. Like I said, so hard for Sentinel to get away from Magneto and keep him in such lockdown. But getting two meters and bringing in Strider, Clockwork, great position to take this round right now. That'll do it. Never an easy victory here in EVO 2010. One game to one. EMP, IFC, Yipes with MSP. Clockwork takes game two. Really nice. Clockwork, the San Diego OG. Uh, participated in the advanced tactics videos. He is responsible for innovating some of the common high level tactics in this game. And he is still competitive to this day. As our house announcer said, he'd like to see it go a game apiece and come down to that last one. And that's what we've got. Very smart right there. The, the, Clock's got the orbs up. 
Yikes. Getting him out with the sidewalk. Did not finish his combo right there. I do not like that from Yanks. It looks like he's a little bit flustered. Usually he will confirm two hits and finish, but he didn't finish just there. And now he's giving Clockwork a chance. Clockwork, he's going to take the chance. He's going to take the chance. Down in the corner. Oh, extended combo. Oh, and a reset. Nice reset. Yanks was mashing. That reset was not clean. Yanks was mashing. He's flustered. He's bringing in Storm. Worth the two meters to get Mags out. Give him another chance Strider. Definitely, definitely. Strider's one of those characters in this game that has very, very low health as well. So he's always a liability as well Ooh, as like an asset. Clockwork, putting up the orbs again. He's going to make another pass. Let's see if Yipes is able to block the orbs this time. Those high-low mix-ups that are coming from Clockwork are pretty fast. The teleports uh, also getting really crafty with those cross-unders. And even if you uh, manage to avoid it, you're just in block stun. Locked down. This is the trap. Orbs locked down. He caught him trying to get out. The trap. There's the reset. Oh, That's what I was talking baby. about. There's the grab. He's going to DAC. Triple DAC. Yep, you got one more chance. What have you got for me? He's still my heart. Clockwork sitting on about 65%. Incredible positioning with this match right now. He is on cruise control. Orbs are up. Yipes taking to the skies. He doesn't want any part of those that block stun. Yipes is not one. There it is. Sidelock's out. Did he catch her? Sidelock's out. Did not, did catch, not her. catch her. Doesn't matter. Yipes did not want Clockwork building meter from those orbs off his normals to do it again. I think it did not is, work out for him. Yeah, Yipes is not going to give up. But good lord, he has a mountain to climb right here. Getting out of this. Lock down in the short. corner. There it is. He opened him up with a teleport and then going low. Yipes. Clockwork Yipes going to losers to Clockwork, the OG San Diego represent.